we're having our morning breakfast with bread, bread, and bread. But also got some potato chips. Yum. We are back at the hotel and I wanted to show you this bathroom. It's really pretty tile in here. Um, it's got a gold background. And the shower is very pretty too, more of the gold tile. And it has like four different ways of spraying water at you. We've made a mess in here, but Still a super nice room with um, like nine different settings for the ceiling lights. Okay, maybe six, but still exciting. <laughs> Good. <laughs> How do you like it? Oh, it's fun. Yeah, that's these, fun. These can never not be fun. <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> we got a rogue horse. <laughs> oh man. That's so cool. They can ride fast out here. Mm -hmm. So cool. It's quite the experience out on the desert. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right now we are on a mission to find postcards, which is kind of difficult, but we just did our ATV ride. It was really fun. Britain had a blast. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, we got to see the pyramids and we got to see also what's out in that desert and there isn't much out there. It looks like some of it is a trash and some of it um, might have had buildings a long time ago and it's just a few pieces of rubble now. But there's nothing out there. Um, the pyramids are really pretty though. The smog cleared up and our guide um, was like a, a teenager. He was having a lot of fun. He took us on some really steep hills. I was screaming, mm. but I did it. <laughs> um, yeah, we, we're gonna hopefully find some postcards, get some good takeout dinner, and then call it a night because we have to get up at like three in the morning tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Boiling hot. Boiling hot. Very good. <clears throat> yeah, everything here is served at boiling temperature. It is our last night in Egypt and it's been a really crazy 10 days. I'm excited to be back home only because I cannot handle all this smog. <laughs> the back of my throat is itchy. I constantly have a headache. Um, and like my boogers are black. I just, I've lived in the country too much. <laughs> I'm not used to city life and it's thick here. Every, everywhere you're constantly like breathing in, uh, the fumes from all the cars. Other than that, it's been amazing. Uh, I wasn't able to take my camera this camera on the ATV ride because the police don't like these kind of cameras anywhere really. Some places I could have a normal camera but most of the time they only wanted the mobile or the cell phone. Um, you can use that. 
we're hoping to get the same dinner as last night and they call sandwiches like they call it a sandwich but what would you call it it's like a kind of like a burrito oh the shawarmas the shawarmas it's like a euro like a euro uh yeah like an arab euro it's super good and then whatever kind of beef quesadilla we had that was really good too oh yeah still really hot <laughs> Here's uh, first dinners. We've got the green salad from the boat to the Nubian village. I really like it. It's got tomatoes, um, cilantro, and cucumbers. And then we've got some french fries. Hopefully they're curry flavored. They are. Oh, I can smell it. Yes, they're curry flavored. We've got some uh, ruta, ketchup, <laughs> and then shawarmas, which are also called sandwiches. Um, yes, very good. It's a uh, mixed meat, so they say meat or chicken, and meat is like lamb or beef, maybe mixed together, that they cut off of the big spinning beef stick. And then, what did we buy for the other part of dinner? Hashash. Hashash? I think. It's like a quesadilla. A beef quesadilla. Or a meat quesadilla. It's super good. It's also got onion in it and some carrots. Not a creamsicle. <laughs> I got orange. It changed it. <laughs> okay. Good morning, everyone. We are in a hotel room and we should be home at our apartment. We are not because the car didn't start. Um, <laughs> so we were at the, we left the car at the airport for 10 days. And it got a little cold. My battery kind of sucks. So um, it either is completely frozen or completely died or something. We tried to get a jump last night at like 10 when we got in and it didn't work. So we walked to the hotel. We've stayed here. Um, and now we're going to get an Uber to O'Reilly's down the street. Pick up a new battery and Britain will hopefully be able to replace it in the parking lot. The high today is 34 degrees. It's probably going to snow. And all that makes it so much fun. Um, we're just really wanting to get home. Um, the travel back was really difficult. 12 hours was our longest flight. And um, yesterday with the time change was like a 34 hour day for us. Felt like it was never gonna end. Um, but yes, we're back and we're back to everyday problems. Like car's not working. <laughs> okay, I'll show you a little bit of how this all goes and I'll let you know when we make it back home safe and sound. Oh. <laughs> 
We are off to <laughs> save the battery. It's a little bit snowy out. It is so cold right now. I hope this uh, doesn't take too long because it is so cold. Britain's changed batteries before, so he definitely knows what he's doing. It's just, it's super cold out and uh, frozen hands do not make good tools. We have had quite a long trip. It's just not fun to come home to this. We were wanting really badly to be in our own beds, of course, and to have uh, just time to rest, recuperate. Um, the hotel room was nice though. Hot shower, so he got the positive off. Yay! Whee! Okay, halfway there. Well, that was quick. Just pulled it out. Nice. The battery was too bit dead to unlock itself with the key fob, so now every time we put juice back into the car, I think somebody's breaking in. Britton said he would drive us back, which I am so excited. Oh, the light's on. So we took a very nice Uber to get the battery and um, she was saying that we're gonna get one to three inches today in this area. I have no idea what we're gonna get because um, we live a few hours away from here. Maybe we're getting more or less snow, I'm not sure. But uh, I'm also just a little bit worried this much about our apartment. Um, because we don't have a thermostat in it, it's got these uh, space heaters in the wall and they kind of just have dials, there's no numbers associated with it, it's just kind of like an on-off switch. I'm excited to see how the apartment is, everything's okay. Um, yeah, definitely just want to relax. We had an alarm still set. Um, 4 3 30 in the morning because that's what time we had to wake up to catch the plane um in egypt and <laughs> it went off this morning again so i've been up since 3 30 because of that alarm which is fine they had a really nice breakfast at the hotel super good super good to have a breakfast i'm used to we've had um the running joke is we've had a lot of bread breakfast we have morning breakfast, <laughs> just lots of bread, some eggs if you're lucky. <laughs> I definitely loved the trip, but winter is here. It's not coming anymore. Winter is here and we need to prepare for it. The Uber driver was like, you guys got snow tires? And I was like, no, <laughs> we're a little bit behind. <laughs> I don't know if I will get snow tires, to be honest. I have all-wheel drive on the car. And I've got street tires, and I do have a couple trips planned where I'd need to drive. Um, so maybe it'd be good to get snow tires or chains or something, but I also think I'll be sticking to major highways. So I think I'll be fine. I don't know. <sighs> okay. I'll show you guys when we get the battery all in and we're driving down the road and all that fun stuff. <laughs> the time has come. Oh my god! Yay! Ah, oh, this is so exciting! <laughs> oh my god, this is too much! 
Ah, this is better than my birthday. <laughs> we went and made the car work. Yes. So excited. So, so excited. Mm -hmm. You okay? I just don't want to die. I know. Let me check. We just um, slid into the ditch. Britain's checking the hood. Um, the battery isn't secure. We should check and make sure it's not fallen. Yeah, I got it. 